Time is the most precious commodity in the America's Cup. Although it feels like a long three-year campaign, there's a whole lot of deadlines within that. As designers that rely more and more on computational modeling and optimization, the ability to run those simulations really quickly on powerful machines is absolutely paramount. By using the HP cluster in particular has really given us a massive advantage in buying us more time. Whereas other teams developed smaller test boats, we put all of our efforts into making our first AC75 yacht full size and develop all of the technology of that in simulation on our computers. We were confident that by the time we launched it, we would have a yacht that would be extremely competitive. Having the sailors spend time on the simulator before we actually sail the boat is immense. Seeing how the boat reacts in a dynamic way really taught us a lot, but it also, we were able to simulate situations that were less desirable, have crashes and spills that we could learn from, which would have been incredibly costly to do on the water. The America's Cup has always been a design race, and it's about having the technology available to you to push the design and optimization of the yachts as hard as you can. And HP has been absolutely crucial partner and part of Team New Zealand in this campaign for the America's Cup. 